The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how to perform a Doppler blood pressure on a patient with a ventricular assist device. A Doppler is a small portable handheld device that uses ultrasound waves to make a pulse easier to hear. This is helpful for patients with traumatic injuries or shock. We also use this for patients whose pulse is difficult to hear with a stethoscope due to swelling, obesity, or blood flow problems. It is the primary way that we detect blood pressure in patients with ventricular assist devices. To perform a Doppler blood pressure, you will need a Doppler device, ultrasound gel, a paper towel, and a manual blood pressure cuff. Before you start, please sanitize your hands. Don gloves if there is any risk of coming into contact with body fluids. We typically perform Doppler blood pressure at the brachial artery. We will also demonstrate how to take it at the radial artery in case a patient's brachial artery is too difficult to locate or hear. To start, apply the blood pressure cuff to the patient's arm. Next, position your patient's arm on a pillow or other supportive surface at heart height. Have them turn their palm towards the ceiling, then place a quarter-sized amount of ultrasound gel at the area of the brachial artery. Turn the Doppler on and use the wheel at the side to turn the volume up. Securely hold the Doppler head over the brachial artery. Be mindful not to push too hard as you can occlude the blood flow. Slowly move the Doppler head around until a pulse is heard. On a patient with an LVAD, this will likely sound more like a subdued alternating whooshing sound rather than a distinct heartbeat. Keep the ultrasound head still as you inflate the blood pressure cuff to 30 millimeters mercury past where the pulse is no longer heard. Keeping your eye on the pressure gauge, slowly release the pressure from the cuff. When you hear your first alternating whooshing sound, that will be recorded as your mean arterial pressure. In certain cases, you will need to use the radial artery. Your setup will be the same as performing a brachial artery blood pressure, but the ultrasound head will be at the base of the thumb and the cuff will be on the forearm. If you have difficulty hearing the sound, adjust the position of the ultrasound head until the alternating whooshing sound is heard. <laughs> 